Heavenly Father, today I want to take the time to pray for all animals, all animals all over this world, Father God, for you to release your divine protection, your angelic protection over all animals all over this world, all over America, all over Canada, and all over Israel, and all seven continents of this earth, Heavenly Father. I pray for your divine protection over all animals everywhere in this world. Father God, from all evil, danger, and harm during this Halloween season. Heavenly Father God, and first before I start praying for all animals all over the world, which I'm going to be praying, uh, Psalm 121 from the King James Version Bible over all animals. And I'm going to be praying some prayers and a spiritual warfare prayer pamphlet booklet by Mark I. Bubak. I'm going to be praying a couple prayers for the animals, which is related to children, but I'll uh, transfer in, um, tra- for, ch- for animals, replace it for plan- praying for animals all over the world instead of children like I did in the previous video that I prayed recently today. So, Father God, before I go into praying for all animals all over this world and giving all animals over to you and to your hands, Father God, I'm going to take the time to say some thanks to you, Father God. Give thanksgiving unto you, my Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, I just thank you and I praise you, Father God. I give you glory and honor, Father God, for the wonderful God that you are, Father God. I thank you for your goodness and your kindness and your grace and your favor, your unconditional love for me and all your children and for all mankind. Father God, I just thank you and I praise you that you also love all animals and you love all children. Heavenly Father, which you have also created, and I thank you for the beautiful creatures of animals that you have created, Father God. And I thank you for creating me and creating everything, Father God, that you have created on this earth and for people that you have created, Father God. I thank you, Father God, for your goodness and your grace and your favor upon me, Father God, and that you are looking out for me and you're taking good care of me and you are providing for me. You are the Lord, my shepherd, that I shall not want, Father God, and that you provide that you provide for me and all your children, Father God, everywhere in this world. And I thank you for your divine protection, Father God, and for sending your angels to guard and protect me and your children and to protect the animals and the children, Father God, and all the persecuted lambs that are being persecuted through these modern day slavery programs of all types everywhere in the world. I thank you, Father God, for sending your angels to fight for me and fend for me and to release blessings for me, Father God, and deliverance for me and my life, Father God, and deliverance for all the ones that are held in bondage, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Father, I thank you and I praise you, Father God, for breathing your life inside of me and waking me up. This morning, this past morning, Father, for getting me through this day, helping me do these podcasts, directing me and guiding me and giving me creativity for the Holy Spirit and for your word and for your son, Jesus Christ, for the holy blood of Jesus Christ. Father God, I thank you, Father God, so much for being so kind to me and always being there for me, never leaving me nor forsaking me, that you're a God of love and you are love, Father God, you are never going to abuse me. You're never going to use me or betray me or lie to me because it's impossible for you to be cruel, Father God, because you are the God of love. You are love and there is nothing but truth in you, Father God, so it's impossible for you to lie. So, Father God, I just thank you that you're honorable and honest and integrous, Father God. I serve a wonderful, loving God like you, integrous, righteous God like you, my Heavenly Father. And I'm so honored for you to be my father and that I'm your child for 
accepting me and receiving me and approving of me, Father God, that you are for me, you are with me, Father God, forever. You're on my side and you got my back, Father God. And I thank you, Father God, for your faithfulness and for your gentleness, for your long suffering and your patience and your forgiveness toward me, your kindness and your favor and your grace and mercy toward me, Father God, for imparting your love and mercy upon me and your blessings upon me and your countenance and presence upon me, that you are surrounded with me and with your presence and you are comforting me on every side, Father God, that you are my comforter and consoler, my God, Father God, you are my Lord and my Savior, and my rock and my shield and my fortress, Father God, you are good to me all the time. Father God, you are my deliverer and redeemer, Father God, sustainer and hiding place, Father God and habitation and shelter, Father God, and that you are hiding me from the secret counsel of the wicked, Father God, and under your pavilion, Father God, and that you are honoring me and releasing salvation in every area of my life. You are my deliverer, Father God. You are my healer, Father God. You are my consoler, my comforter. You are the one that's given me the strength to cope and to deal with the evil people that I have to deal with every day and the evil situations that I have to deal with and that you are delivering me from very stubborn situations and out of slavery and tyranny and oppression, Father God, and out of imprisonment, Father God, and that you are delivering me from mean-spirited people and mean controllers and handlers and witches and warlocks that you are fighting my battles for me father god and going ahead of me because the battles that i'm going through father is yours alone and you are fighting for me and you are subduing my enemies underneath me and you are my great defense father god you are my avenger you are avenging my enemies my spiritual and natural enemies father god And vengeance is only yours, Father God. And you're a spiritual warrior, fighter, victorious, conqueror, fighter, Father God. And you are spiritually fighting every demon spirit and defeating every demon spirit that come against me. And you're subduing my enemies underneath me, Father God, by your mighty hand and your powerful spirit, Father God. Thank you, Father God, for just taking care of me. And providing for me and looking out for me and just sustaining me and just giving me the coping skills to cope and to persevere and increase in my faith the trust in you to keep my foot from slipping and sliding Father God into sin and for forgiving me for my sins and just having grace toward me Father God and that you're not punishing me the way I deserve to be punished Father God because of your grace and your mercy Father God that you are good to me and you're looking out for me and thank you for healing me and my body my soul from any type of abuse and trauma and harassment by the God and infirmities in Jesus Christ's name and healing all your children Heavenly Father God and thank you for looking out for the children and protecting the animals and healing the animals from any type of trauma too Father God in Jesus Christ's name Amen Now, Father God, I want to take the time to pray for animals that are being traumatized and for your divine protection for animals during this Halloween season. Father, I pray that you would just uh, protect all animals everywhere in this world, everywhere in America and in Canada and in Israel, Father God, and all seven continents of this earth, Father God, from all evil, danger, and harm, and from abuse satanic ritualistic abuse and torture father god and from evil predators and abductions father god and kidnappings too and satanic ritual murder father god in jesus christ's name from being slain by evil satanists in jesus christ's name during this halloween season and after father god and during the rest of the months of the holidays of this year of 2019 father i pray that you will release your heavy shield of protection and hedge of protection 
Father God, upon the children, I mean, upon the children, yeah. But first, now, in this video, Father, we're praying for animals. I'm praying for animals. Upon the animals, everywhere in this world, Father God, all types of animals, Father, domestic animals, zoo animals, wild animals, Father God, and upon the sea, the fish animals, sea animals as well, Father God. Upon the birds, Father God, as well. And the, and the eagles, all the different types of birds. And Father God, upon the farm animals, upon cats and dogs, and upon all animals, Father God. The horses, all of them, Father God. And... The wild jungle animals in Jesus Christ's name, the homeless animals, the animals in uh, shelters and animal shelters and and animal nurseries and stuff, Father God, and the animals is in hospitals, animal hospitals in Jesus Christ's name, animals everywhere in this world, everywhere in America and in Canada and in Israel, Father God. That you will put your hedge and shield of protection upon these animals to cover them with the blood of Jesus Christ, Father God. That you will cover these animals with the blood of Jesus Christ everywhere in the world, with the blood of Jesus Christ from the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet, their spirit, souls, and bodies, and their lives, and their health, and health, Father God, and their bodily intestines, bones, and blood of these animals with the blood of Jesus Christ, their limbs, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, their ears and teeth and gums, Father God, and tails, in Jesus Christ's name of these animals, their feet and and bones and blood, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, and the personalities and the wills of these animals and their brains of these animals with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I pray that you will send your angels to watch over these animals everywhere in the world to guard and protect these animals from all evil danger and harm and to war and fight against all demon spirits that prey against these animals everywhere in the world, Father God. That your angels will fight and war and defeat every demon spirit that come against any animal to want to hurt any animal in this world, Father God, everywhere in the world. In Jesus Christ's name, that you will send your army of angels everywhere in every nation of this world. Father God, every continent of this world, Father God, in America, in North America, in Africa. In Asia, Father, in Europe, in Antarctica, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, South America, Father God, and hopefully I didn't miss any continent, in every continent, Australia, Father God, all these places, Antarctica, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, New Zealand, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Please protect the animals in Japan and China, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Oh, Father God, in Canada, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, in Israel, Father God, all over this world, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. And I thank you for protecting the animals from premature death and murder and and evil from doing the Halloween season. A sound, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name and after Halloween season. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God. Even on All Souls Day and All Saints Day. In Jesus Christ's name as well, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name, Father that you will pour the blood of Jesus Christ upon these animals, Father God, to be a barrier between any evil spirit and evil witchcraft attacks. In Jesus Christ's name, sent by witches and warlocks. In Jesus Christ's name, that you will put your glory shield around these animals all over the world, covered with the blood of Jesus Christ and the fire of the Holy Spirit to will off any type of witchcraft attacks. A witchcraft tax released against these animals from any witches and wizards, Father God, all over this world. In Jesus Christ's name. Now, Father God, I want to pray Psalm 121 over all the animals from the King James Version Bible, Father God. 
Father, I thank you that the animals all over.